Luke and Becca here at the Outdoor Boys YouTube channel, and we're going to take you to the past, back to 2007. Me and Rebecca went to southern India to visit my parents. They were living there and working as uh, missionaries for our church, and uh, we visited, spent about 19 days, and uh, it was absolutely amazing, and we're going to take you along for the ride. Uh, Becca, for years, has been asking me to take this old footage and put it together into a video. And, and so here it is, and we're gonna give you our commentary over the top. So come with us back to 2007, before children, before I was doing YouTube, and uh, enjoy the ride. Here we are. Becca and I have just bought tickets to India. Four thousand six hundred dollars in non-refundable airfare. You were young and skinny. Look at, look at that. Look at this. <laughs> this. I was back in law school. This was our, our one-bedroom apartment in Crystal City, Virginia, back when I was going to George Mason for law school. It was really stressful buying the tickets, though. They were expensive. Yeah, that was a lot of money for us. Yeah. Yeah, that was a lot of money. But we were like, when are we ever going to get to go and visit my parents in India again? Yeah. Anyway, 35 hours on a plane, and uh, we were crashing on my parents' floor. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, oh, it was such a crazy ride, I uh, too, getting over there. All right, this is, here we are, Bangalore, India. Here's mom. And over there, that right there is a the little boy who just hit her with a soccer ball. <laughs> That's nice. But this is, this is really interesting. We visited a lot of just little parks and just drove around the city. I mean, there were no tourists there. I mean, it, Bangalore is not a touristy place. And it's a beautiful city, but mm. so many nice people. People there are just amazing. Yeah. But, beautiful, kind. But look at, look at this. This is, this is uh, some foreshadowing for my, my uh, days at the Catfish Conference here. I was just basically <laughs> signing autographs and taking photos with people. Oh, like they would do that with all of us, and it, because we were like, it was we were tall and yeah, tall white people. They yeah. were just like, oh my god, just I want a picture with you, and then yeah. we just get mobbed by people who wanted yeah. to take their photo with us. Just and wanted like, our autographs, like who <laughs> wants our autographs? Yeah. So it was kind of like being a celebrity without being a celebrity. But the most entertaining thing in the world to do in India is to drive down the road. Scary. It's just so so much to see. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. See this gal right there in the orange and white behind my sister, or maybe the green. Uh, I think it was no, it was a girl, girl in the orange and white. She she they were stalking us. <laughs> it turns out they came up and like wanted to take our pictures. Like here they are, like like wanted to take our pictures. No nothing unusual. But later on in the park, the the mom and dad came up and took their daughter and just like dropped her right next to me, and then just like ran for it. They like ding dong ditched their daughter yeah. like i think they wanted wanted to do like some arranged marriage or crap because they just like dropped her off and, and ran, ran for, for it uh, and we had to go sprinting after them and chase them down and give them their daughter back and i was like no 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 you know married married married, married. <laughs> <laughs> you know sorry you're a very nice lady i'm sure but you know this ain't gonna work oh gosh wife number two we jokingly call yeah her. that's wife number two so anyway christmas morning and uh we we woke up my sister by jumping on her and giving her like a pile driver or something, you know. Oh, uh, we had a great time. This is it was such it was so much fun just to be hanging out with the family in <laughs> India. But my parents were in charge of all the missionaries in India, uh, Sri Lanka, parts of Nepal, and stuff like that. So on Christmas, which really isn't a huge holiday in India, they'd have all the missionaries over and they. And my mom made like a, a you know Western style breakfast for him anyway. Oh, but here on Christmas Day we went down to the mall, and that is where I bought my India cricketing jersey, which <laughs> you have probably seen in lots of my videos. You know, it, that's over a decade old now. It's 13 years old. There's a reason why it looks so nasty. I'm in Mel's office, and this is Mel sitting at his smile, smile. He's working hard. He's very busy. <laughs> And uh, yeah, there it is. Oh, There's my so Indian good. jersey. My it's cricket, long and white. <laughs> my cricketing jersey. Yeah, yeah. It's, yeah. Here's here's the mission home. This is as kind of the the headquarters for the missionaries in in India, or and then they split it and became Southern India. Uh, We're gonna go try to find a place where Luke can buy cricket bats. Oh, 
Colorado, and we're we're heading downtown to Smyrna. Oh, gotta watch this. Yeah. It's speeding its way through traffic. Yeah. You can tell how noisy it is. Driving down the road was the most entertaining thing in India. Uh, just you'd see the craziest stuff, like. Like two guys and six goats. On a scooter, you know, or, you know, a car, a 18 wheeler would be flipped over, you know, or just like in the middle of the road and like nobody doing anything about it. It was just, it was chaotic and scary and fascinating at the same time. Oh, and these were the creepy Santas. They had a whole bunch of guys dressed up in the like, the most like horror fiction Santa masks. So we're going to go pick up the suits that he had Taylor making. Made while you were there, they yeah, good. yeah, most. They had such interesting oh. stores. Yeah, this antique shop. I mm. bought a bunch of like spearheads and weapons mm. for like five bucks. I bought like a couple hundred year old spear. I love the flower markets. They smelled so good. Oh yeah, this. It was just, India was one of the most interesting places we've ever traveled. We traveled a lot of places. Um, then we jumped up to Delhi. So we were in Bangalore and then we flew to Delhi. Yes, yeah, so this is in Delhi where I did. I know it's a cliche, but I got Delhi belly in Me Delhi. Too. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, uh. <laughs> I am your host, Luke Nichols, and I'm going to be explaining how Indian toilets work. Ooh, let's Even learn. Even fancy ones. Okay, toilet paper is a Western invention. So what you do is you raise the seat, you sit down, when you're done, you rinse off. Off my car. <laughs> like the other day, I saw a goat eating a motorcycle tire. Here we are at the Lotus Temple in Delhi. Here's Melanie. Hi. Oh, beautiful yeah. building. There's Luke. Oh, bartering just for something. So we have been on vacation for one week now. Oh, it's gone by too fast. We're at a World Heritage site. What's the What's the name of this place again? Homeyon Tom. Oh, okay. There's our tide. Yeah, that's India Gate, which is kind of like their World War II uh, memorial. Oh, which is really, really gorgeous. Mm -hmm. The dude with the Sten machine gun. That was cool. Uh, there's Gandhi's tomb. Yes, Gandhi's tomb. Also, also in Delhi. I keep wanting to yell at myself, hold the camera still. <laughs> Let's hold it still. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. Our camera work leaves much to be desired. This is the Red Fort. It was That's, just gorgeous. Oh, I mean, these places are huge and yeah. just amazing. They're mind-blowing palaces. And, yeah. Yeah, you know, we've been to castles all over Europe and palaces all over Europe. This stuff is like, <laughs> you know, bigger. this is so much bigger. Yeah. Ah, oh, the rickshaws. The rickshaws. <laughs> Melanie was so jammed in there. Poor she was Melanie. so uncomfortable. Oh, the wires. Don't look up. Yeah, yeah. I mean, their they're, they're electrical work in India is sketchy on a, on a massive scale. Yeah. It's just... <laughs> just a big rat's nest of wires that yeah. may or may not be live. Yeah, and crazy monkeys. Yeah. They had cool shopping though. <laughs> they had lots of cool. Here we are on the road to Agra to go see the Taj Mahal. The, the highway is just was just crazy. <laughs> okay, my uncle Gene had a pet monkey that bit his freaking ear off, and that is all I am thinking about right now. <laughs> as a his, monkey on your back. This monkey jumped on the back of my neck. I'm like, hold still, don't bite my ear off. <laughs> 500 rupees? That's way too much. Hey. Yeah, I can buy a monkey for 500 rupees. Okay, money, man. Oh. Hey, here's these people just bailing out of the back of a of a truck in front of us on a like six eight lane highway. And there's me oh. riding a camel. Up to the Taj Mahal. <laughs> People stared at me just for being white. Now I'm white and on a camel. So. Well, this is Becca Nichols riding a camel <laughs> on the way to the Taj Mahal. Oh. Wait, wave at the camera. 
So the Taj Mahal, a lot of you have seen pictures of it. The Taj Mahal is amazing, but it's this one building inside a massive, amazing complex. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's huge. It's absolutely huge. And it's, you know, it looks white and because it's all marble. And, and the rest is this red sandstone, you know. But you look at the, the, the surface of the Taj Mahal, it's just covered in all this inlay, this... Oh, Semi-precious stones, they're beautiful. It's amazing, it's just, yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. Yeah, it's funny, you see the pictures of it, and I never even realized that there was decoration on the outside. It always just looks like it's, it's white. It's just white. But, yeah, it's so pretty. This has been fun. Here we are at the church in KGF, India. We just saw a baptism. Okay. Uh, this is this. We went to church the next day at a small uh, mining town called KGF, and uh, there was a, a gal who got baptized on the roof of the building, and we went to the baptism. That was kind of cool. We're now back in southern India. And yeah, this is southern India. This is this is uh, 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 a banyan tree. This is on the way to Mysore. Mm -hmm. Around uh, yeah. here. And there's Becca. Bunches of monkeys in this park. You can see them. And my kids are traumatized with stories of Uncle Gene's monkeys. I like my ears. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, ears. <laughs> okay, Mysore holds a special place in my heart because this is where I truly learned to barter. Like, mm, I like, good. it clicked. It clicked in yeah. Mysore. And it was New Year's Eve. And uh, after we went around and saw this palace, I went off to the markets by myself and just bought whatever I could just to barter as much as possible. And and the the gals went and saw this uh, these big fountains and stuff, mm -hmm. and then we all met up back at the hotel for Christmas uh, for New Year's, New Year's Eve. Eve. New Year's yeah, Eve. there were fireworks and music. Our hotel room. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that! <laughs> <laughs> I love how all the staffs out here just blowing crap up. People are dancing by the fire and there are fireworks and things and they're trying to convince Luke to dance. It's pretty funny. <laughs> Look at these two bulls are fighting there. Oh! <laughs> You're driving to my store like, herd of cows. I remember the... Uh, <laughs> You're listening to... Bollywood music. Yeah. I remember I went and bought a whole bunch of Bollywood albums uh -huh. in a music store, and a cow was inside the music store, <laughs> just like pissing all over the floor. <laughs> oh, here now we're at we're at Kabini River Lodge. It's this really cool lodge on the Kabini River. It's a national park in southwest uh, India. <laughs> okay, so while everyone was kind of resting at the lodge, I got bored and the driver, I was like, hey, what's to do around here? And he said, well, we could go visit the, these remote jungle schools. I'm like, sure, let's do that. So we went to this like little mud hut like convenience store literally mud hut convenience store and i bought up all the school supplies they had in the whole village and it was like 30 bucks or something and and we went down to these these little schools and just handed out pens and papers and stuff and, and i was like ooh, a big you know honored guest or something so all the kids did a little performance and came up and they all wanted to practice their english and the teacher wanted to do like photo ops like this is like long hand hold yeah a lot of people would hold your hands in india it's like hand holding between men it was like a, a total thing over there okay thank you okay goodbye 
<laughs> okay. Oh, so you're a cricket player? Yes. I, I learned cricket last week. Well, congratulations on being a good, good student. Thank you. Huh? Thank you very much. Oh, my God. Manjunata Swami. Manjunata Swami. Yes. Oh, you very much. This one I don't know. Yes. No, you like? Okay. Appointment, you just showed up. Yeah, like they like shut down the school for like 30 minutes to shake hands with some white guy handing out ballpoint ball point pads. It was weird, but I had a great time. We got to go on a safari. Yes. It was so cold that morning. <laughs> Here's a bowl. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, you're so bad at holding the camera. I know, just hold it still. <laughs> it's so inconsistent with our videos, oh. too. It was hard, like, when you're zoomed out, though, too. And this is old school cameras. And... Uh, no no digital stabilizers, no oh. anti-shake. Yeah, this is, this is... But I was really bad at it, too. We <laughs> were also really bad at it. <laughs> Yeah, we saw we saw probably half a dozen Indian elephants. I I, I didn't include all the footage in here. Um, there was a lot of lot of video from this this safari, but we saw some, a lot of cool animals. Yeah, we didn't see a tiger and we didn't see a leopard, but just about everything else. Yeah, that's a jungle chicken. It's a wild chicken. <laughs> jungle chicken. Yeah. So pretty. Yeah. Maybe they'd trump it. It was it just sounds so cool. Yeah. a bird eating something. Ready? You, some of the safaris they would do on the backs of elephants and stuff, like you go looking for the tigers and stuff, and you could you could do a safari on by elephant back. And so these were the elephants that would they would truck people around. Yeah. They were chill. Chill. I like the baby one. Yeah. Oh, the baby one in there. He was just going down, sucking on his dude's hand. Yeah, just like just like a just little like, a, baby. like yeah. a little human baby, just like yeah. suck anything you give it, put it in its mouth. <laughs> Here's Becca. Okay, so and we went out on one. the river. And, and and the gals, uh, everyone else went on the powerboat. Mm -hmm. And then they had this giant wicker basket with a blue tarp <laughs> underneath it called a coracle boat. And they're like, do you want to go on that? I'm like, heck yeah, that looks sketchy. I want to be a part of that. I'm pretty sure they were crocodile infested waters. There were crocodiles. We saw we saw some crocodiles. But yeah, that's me. I, that's a giant whisk, wicker basket. Yeah. And they've just put like six layers of like plastic bags and tarps underneath it and there wasn't mm -hmm. that much leaking Can going on and <laughs> and this dude would just sit there in his little stool and he would paddle, paddle it yeah i keep saying i need to do a video about making a coracle boat that was just that was cool that was cool that was cool you didn't get eaten by crocodiles <laughs> but i was like holding really still i'm like this thing is tippy and i am big <laughs> they put like four indian guys in the other boat and just me and this, this boat. they're like uh-uh <laughs> that is a Why? big that was a big fat white dude we're we're keeping him by himself uh, so here we go the lodge Here's, was so cool that was a cool lodge that was, cool that was lodge. very cool uh, I was really excited about the jungle chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Rightfully so. All right. And then suddenly we're in Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. Ooh, yeah. We took a flight. Movie okay. magic. This was during the Civil War in Sri Lanka. Like my, my parents were working in Sri Lanka and in this hotel earlier when there was like a suicide plane attack and my dad was in the bathroom like called home like hey yeah there's anti-aircraft fire out the window they're, sh they're shooting planes down out here you know <laughs> oh my goodness this is so beautiful there's all the people falling in the fish net oh, oh this is gonna help fall in the fish net <laughs> In search of an elephant ride. There's an elephant. Hopefully. Thank you. It's Monica. Monica the elephant. I really wanted to ride on an elephant. 
We, we saw that like a travel show before we went to India, like mm-hmm. somebody riding on the beach on an elephant. And we're like, we're doing that. Mm-hmm. And and we we uh, we did what it takes to ride an elephant on a beach in Sri Lanka. It was so cool. Yeah, that was way cool. It was, yeah, it was just gorgeous. Yeah. It was the most beautiful beach, and we're yeah. riding an elephant down the beach. Yeah. It was awesome. Yeah. It was like 10 bucks or something. The elephant's gotten in trouble because he was pulling off some of the landscaping uh, for the hotel. Look at how beautiful this is, and look how beautiful my wife is. That looks in the Indian Ocean. We're on a beautiful, beautiful beach. I wish we, we we had to so hurry back. We had like five minutes to go put our toes in the water and go like swim for like three minutes and then yeah. dry off and get back in the car. We had to. Yeah. We were Say such a tight schedule. And then we pretty much flew back to. Th- Thirty-five India. hours back home. Yeah. 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 Oh, that was a good time. Well, anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed watching this. Thanks for watching. Click subscribe. We'll see you next Saturday. If you like this video, don't forget to check out the Outdoor Boys YouTube channel where we have hundreds of videos just like this. And don't forget to click subscribe so you can see other great videos every Saturday morning. And hit that bell button so you'll get notifications. Thanks for watching.